this is my room. It is teal, my favourite colour. White and black. I think it has a really nice contrast to it. There's my shoes, if you like looking at shoes. Here's a nice picture. I love this picture. It's by MC Escher. And if you don't know MC Escher, you probably know his art. Here's a close-up of the picture. You probably know it. It's like the never-ending stairs that just keep going round and round and round. So no matter which way you look at it, it either goes up constantly or down constantly. All of my furniture in this room is either black or white. I just really like the contrast of the black and the white with the teal background. I really like it. My double bed, also the same colour scheme. A nice big TV, which is a must for every bedroom. It's a 4K TV and I got it with the same time that I got the PlayStation Pro. Purely just to play Red Dead Redemption 2 on when that first came out. Oh, who's that handsome fella in the mirror? My emergency medicine cabinet. My everyday MacBook. Obviously looking at the best website in the world. This is my driving rig. Uh, I think it's about £450. Worth every penny though, because I have used it a lot when I was really battering Gran Turismo Sport. Then we come into my main computer, the iMac. This is what I use for streaming, editing videos and thumbnails, etc. Flanked with some really nice studio speakers. And it is now official, I am not only number one teacher, but also world's best teacher. I mean, look, I have awards for it and everything. Out of my window, where I can keep tabs on my Audi TT S-Line Special Edition, with a fixed spoiler. Very rare indeed. Love this car, amazing to drive, good acceleration, and just brilliant handling. A gaming chair that I've never once used for gaming. It's just comfortable to sit in my computer with. I can't remember how big this TV is, but it's the perfect size for the distance that I set out from it. Uh, oh, what are these doing here? Uh... So that's a basic tour of my room. Now I'm going to show off my funky lights. I have three of these lamps in my room. There's one here, one over that side, and one right by my Mac. And this is what it looks like when I'm streaming. And I'll get back to this setup in a sec. So each of these lamps has a special bulb in it. They're only £8 each. And you can change them to any colour you like. So we have the blue, we've got red. They have yellow, there's purple, greens, you name it. And they come with a little remote control. Best money I've ever spent. I absolutely love these lamps. A lush ambience when it's really dark, as you can see, it's dark outside. And you can change it to whatever mood you like. I think they're brilliant. And some of the best money I've ever spent. Here is the remote for the bulbs. Uh, each bulb comes with its own individual remote, but you can just use one to control all of them in your room. If you like one, I'll put a link in the description. Now I'm just going to give a quick rundown on how I stream and my setup because doing a full guide will need its own complete video. So here is the Elgato HD60 S Plus. One end goes into the back of the Mac and the other lead goes into the back of the PlayStation. This is the charging unit for my controller and this is the mic that I use for streaming. This is my Streamlab software. It's quite complicated to get used to but once you know what you're doing it is pretty simple. It works really well and has a ton of features. I also have a rather large file on everything GTA. So this one here is the Elite Challenges with timestamps. This page here is solely for everything casino heists. This one here is all of my garages and every car that's in them. I have all of my crew colours, import export statistics, acceleration statistics for nearly every car in the game, and a load more because I'm a bit of a nerd. For creating thumbnails, I just use Pages, a built-in application on the Mac. It's super easy to use and just does everything that I need. And then for video editing, I just use iMovie. Again, it's just really simple to use and it's another bit of software built into the Mac. Now, when I'm streaming, I bring all of my equipment over close to my bed. It's a bit of a pain in the bum, but I'm way more comfortable here. Plus, I can't fit my chair into that space so I can look at the screen as I'm gaming. And there it is. That's my bedroom. That's my setup. And I'd just like to say a massive thank you to all my members. I think I only started streaming about eight months ago and it's been superb. I love it. I massively appreciate each and every one of you that's supporting me. And if you enjoyed this video, please do leave it a like and I'll see you all again soon.